The FBI nabbing a leader of one of Detroit's deadliest gangs. It's part of one of the Fed's ongoing efforts to dismantle that gang and others wreaking havoc in the city. The now's Jonathan Carlson live on the east side with a look at this story. Jonathan? Hey, yeah, good afternoon, guys. That uh, gang calling this area the red zone here, and the U.S. attorney says uh, if she has her way, they'll soon be out of business. Take a look at the area that we're in here. U.S. attorney Barbara McQuaid talking to us in her Detroit office moments ago. She's handed down a handful of indictments. A sweep, months in the making, nabbed a leader of the Seven Mile Bloods, one of the city's most violent gangs claiming this area off Seven Mile on the east side as their own. She says Detroit has a neighborhood gang problem as opposed to some other major cities, which see a wider spread presence. And to reduce the problem, she says officials are hard at work on prevention to reduce gang recruitment. And she hopes stories like this put gang leaders on notice. You know, gang violence is one of the drivers of homicide and violent crime in Detroit. So we've really made it um, a focus. And the feds say that more indictments could be coming. We'll have much more coming up on Action News at 6. For now, we're live on the east side. I'm Jonathan Carlson, the Now Detroit.